Dollar General 2024 remodels are still hopping. If you want to be entered into our weekly free remodel locations, please leave um, a comment below with the states you shop in. And uh, make sure that you contact Carrie at Super Sunday Sweep if you would like more information about your own remodel locations. You can find her on Facebook, YouTube, and uh, Telegram. Good evening. I guess it's late. Good late night. Um, e here. E's penny shopping. I meant to have this video up already for my penny locos and penny minis. But as I was researching um, one of my stores, I actually came across some new pennies. And again, new pennies for me. It's a remodel location. And just because they're going at my store, it doesn't mean they're going at your store. But I definitely think it's something you guys need to check for because these just started popping up for me. So they're gonna be at the end of the video, but I wanna go ahead and kind of review what to look for in the remodels right now. And there's something you must know that's happening that other people may not be catching it, but we caught it. You guys are gonna know what's up. So let's get to it. All right, what I wanna talk about. This is super duper important. It has never been so important to have screenshots of your list from tonight so that you can compare it after the store flips tomorrow. Here's the reason. You're going to see it with a couple of shampoos that I show you. They are showing half off when you go through all categories. When you actually click on it, they're showing full price. Okay? So you need to know that it's going to be... I have four teenagers upstairs and one of them's yelling Sean is going to go crazy okay so it's very important that you've got those screenshots because we have items that are half off okay and maybe even showing half off in um, on the actual item plus on the um, in the all categories then you go in Sunday and for instance Hey, you know, I know these went and I grabbed them. Great. I know these went, I grabbed them. I know these went, I grabbed them. I know these went, I grabbed them. There's a reason I'm talking about this section. Okay? Because last Sunday, all of these were all, you know, same section. And when you actually scanned them in store, they scanned full price. All right? And I knew they were half price because I had screenshots, right? So at one point, um, I think it was Sarah. Yeah, Sarah and I, um, she had maybe taken one, something up to the register and she was like, hey, I scanned this. It was showing full price, but it just rang up a penny at the register. So now, some stores are going to get very aggravated if you're like, can you scan this? Can you scan this? Can you scan this? Can you scan? Okay. So please do not. If you do not have a screenshot of it showing half price, please do not attempt to go on a scanning frenzy at the register. All right. Because they will get aggravated. I mean, depending on the store. But luckily we were at a really cool store. The employees were awesome, and yeah, they were like, hey, just let us know, and we can check stuff with the handheld. So these were scanning full price on our app, but they were scanning a penny on their handheld and at the register. So, again, you are not going to know to check these things if you don't know they were half off to begin with. And I've heard this happen before with a couple laundry detergents. I hadn't had it happen with so many items. And I will say, there were other ladies that we shopped with. And they put some of these back because they were scanning full price. And then we got them. So, 
go to whatever store you're watching right now or multiple stores, okay, scroll down your list and start screenshotting so that you know tomorrow when it flips, okay, yep, these were shown half price. Why are they scanning full price? I need to check it. Or, hey, these were already zeros because the store probably doesn't carry them, but all the rest of these changed. It's very important to have screenshots the night before. I, I, I can't stress it enough. That's why I've said it 12 times. <laughs> but everybody always asks me, how can I be a better penny shopper? How can I get more? How can I? This, there's so much involved. But the big thing is studying, memorizing, of course, watching my videos and listening to me. Um, I've been to over 250 remodels now. I don't know of any other YouTuber that's, been close to that. Um, so yes, I do feel like I'm pretty knowledgeable um, because I've been doing it so long. Somebody that's new at penny shopping, I want to give you easier ways or easier sections you can go for that you're going to get more pennies. All right. So one of the sections that I think is a good one to go for, and I meant to start with red dot, but I did not, is your baked with love section. Um, I know I've talked about in this in videos, but if you've missed those videos, so your baked with love section, 99% of that section goes. So it's one of those sections that, I mean, you literally can just go up and start grabbing everything off the shelves, right? Always scan before you get up to the register because there may be some randoms, you know, that don't go. But Baked with Love is a great section to go to if you're new and you want to get a bunch of pennies. Then another section would be our, what I refer to as the NCI gift section. And you guys know I've talked about this a lot and same thing. Um, clearly I did not go to this section. <laughs> I go to different sections um, a lot than maybe other people because, well, mainly videos. Um, I'm constantly trying to get, you know, new stuff or stuff that I haven't gotten before. So um, the NCI gift section is usually in your, you know, card and party aisle. And for the most part, most of it also goes. So again, you can go up to that one section, pull everything, and 99% of it's going to be pennies. Okay, next um, would be our As Seen on TV section. Now, our As Seen... Oh, I should have hit Do Not Disturb. Uh, our As Seen on TV section is a little bit different because here's the deal. Um, it changes over time based on what As Seen on TV moves to clearance, okay? So we have a number of items that used to go at Remodels, but then they started getting discounted, and so they have fallen off, which really just kind of means, like, the newer stuff is going... No, there's the new, new stuff that's not going, and then there's the medium level that's not new, new, but it's semi-new that goes. And then you've got the not new, the old, and most of it's discounted. So something else that, one, you could find it in different spots around the store. But again, an area that I would pull everything and then scan before you go to the register and do it that way. Um, but, you know, ahead of time, obviously, you can look it up in your app and... That way you can see, you know, what ones are going, what ones aren't. And these are ones that I just got last weekend. But again, I mean, it does depend on your store. Like the store I was just looking at, um, this flex paste isn't going. And, you know, I just got it last weekend at another store. So it's, you know, kind of random but that's why no matter what I show you you still need to do your own research because it's going to be a store by store basis and the more research you do the more successful you're going to be and that's obviously whoops one of the questions I get asked all the time um how do you get so many pennies? How do you know what's a penny? How do you grab without scanning? It's all just memorization. Um, it's all just years of doing it. But I will have to say, um, I'm going to date myself, but I think most of you are right there with me. Um, if you remember taking I-Step, 
Okay. There was one part of I step where you had to like memorize these random words that weren't even like real words. And then they had this random definition that like wasn't even a real definition. Okay. That's kind of how I go about Dollar General. Mm -hmm. Um, So it's pretty much like some of it doesn't make sense, but I still memorize it. Does that make sense? I don't know. But that's what I'm sticking with, okay? Um, Also, on our NCI gift stuff, um, a lot of this, well, these that I found last weekend were actually in the clearance section. So, again, make sure you're checking everywhere because that NCI gift section, it gets put into the regular NCI section a lot. Um, So, definitely be checking all those different things as well. And another section would be the party section. Um, That is not a section I go for a lot uh, just because, I don't know, I got it a lot, you know, in the beginning or it's just not something that I need. Um, But, like right now, I feel like a lot of it is easy to grab because all of your packaged gift bags are going. Again, make sure you check... Whoa, Paxton. Oopsie. Who knows? Okay, so make sure you're checking. But, you know, it's easy to walk down that aisle and grab. Whoopsie, that now it's my turn. To grab all the packaged gift bags. You know, these stand out. And there's multiple colors, but they're all six packs. So I feel like those are easy to grab. Same with our party tumblers um and usually stores are like overloaded with these if you guys watched my video from last weekend like somebody had already gotten the section with these i pulled like a box full down from the top and i actually use these as um bathroom cups for the boys so i'm not buying the little dixie cups i can just use those for bathroom cups all right next up i only have one Because I didn't go for the section. Um, This was actually just sitting on an end cap. But the athletic fitness section is another section that if you're newer or you just want to get more pennies, this is an easy one. Now, if you do not have a cart, my friend Jeno learned the hard way. Do not fill up a body bag with weights at the first part of the remodel or you are probably going to pull some muscles trying to pull a bag full of weights is not easy but if you have a cart go for it so you go to the fitness athletic section 99 percent of it is also going to go because there were some items on clearance but they recently pennied out so fill up your cart scan you know before you check out but it's another one you can walk into You don't have to know everything that goes. You just get it all in your cart. Okay? Um, Just going along with the party section. um, These I had not gotten before, but we did find a bunch of these. So all these little gift card boxes are going now. There was a happy birthday one. I don't know where I put it. But anyways, um, make sure you're looking for these as well. All right. Next up would be, um, as far as finding remodels or just being able to see something quickly, I swear by the boys' tidy whities um, These will go at every single remodel. If your socks and underwear are going, these are going. It's the small, medium, and large of boys. All of the packages. Um, now, there is a black and red package as well but all of them go so this is one that I keep at the top of my list so then if I am searching it stands out this is also something that usually the stores are overloaded with them they've got them hanging on the pegs plus they've got boxes above they get left behind a lot so the boys briefs are always an easy go-to and then our tagless v-necks All of our V-necks go if they're not white, all right? So the plain white V-necks do not go. But any of the two-pack V-necks, no matter the size, they go. So that's something that you can grab quickly.
and then our blue combo every any size that has the light blue and dark blue shirts they will go as well i really do need to hit do not disturb my locos are up late okay i'll just give you a couple more so our boys blue box are going again but for me it was only small medium extra large but the large didn't go i don't know but i was happy to see that these were going again then our little true living containers you can find these a lot hanging on clip strips people leave them behind forget about them a lot And then, same with these. See, these are not boxer briefs. They're like your old school boxers that are more like shorts. And you can tell the difference because the bands look different. The actual boxer part looks different. So, if you're looking, you know, at boxers side by side, these are going to stand out. That's why, again, I can grab these really easily. And they get missed a lot still and believe me i've been getting these for years <laughs> and then our special hanes bands no matter what size they are they go because the bands you can tell are different um do i not have another regular pair i think most of you know though because a lot of them don't even have a hanes waistband on them so that's why when these are hanging they stand out and this just happens to be the medium but it is all sizes Ooh, is that ketchup <laughs> i don't know about that okay next up our lampshades are going again so i believe there's this color there's a gray and there's a white so these are the old lampshades. Um, our new NCI lampshades are not going. So just make sure they are the $5 ones. Um, I think the NCI lampshades are all more um, like a straight rounded. They don't come out bigger. You know what I'm saying? So these are the ones you want to look for. Okay. And of course, our good cooks. And yes, depending on your store, some of this might have already been phased out. So that's why it's important to have plenty of items to check. So any of our good cook with gray tops. It doesn't matter if it's the three pack rectangle. Um, there's a two pack of a bigger size bowl. And then there's the 20 pack. And again, these stand out. There are not any other... Um, plastic storage, food storage, that looks like these. Same with our two-pack True Living. These have clips. They're two-packs. This is the only one that looks like this. I wanted to point something else out to you guys. Oh, um, the new leg pillow is going again. All right, okay, and then I just want, I want to give you some red dot. Just some examples, um, because obviously these are um, now at 25% off, right? So they are starting to go down, which is great news for us. So they have a variety of just square kids' pillows. They have a variety of our neck pillows. And then... Um, I keep finding these rugs as well because they stand out. And 
And there's another red dot. And they the red dot, there's also the glow in the dark red dots. Okay. Pop those over there. Are two dollar loofahs. Now, not the dollar ones. It's the two dollar ones. And yes, they usually will have a box full. So you can just grab up the whole box like I did at that last um, shopping trip last weekend. Red dot, seersucker, jumbo bed pillow. It's just all white. No lines or anything. I guess there's kind of, you know, lines there. Where's our UPC? Okay. We did that, we did that. I didn't give you the UPCs. These were all up on the top shelf. Somebody else had already gotten the Baked with Love section. And then the candy molds. Okay. These are some new ones that started going. These actually, you know, just started coming out this year. And of course, they are already going, which is awesome for us. Okay. Kitchen section. Um, if you have the extended kitchen section, uh, a lot of them are now popping up. They are getting rid of um, appliances, you know, all the Toastmasters going, skillets, pots and pans, um, a lot of the good cook baking, um, baking pans, pizza pans, I mean, uh, mixing bowls, you name it. So, if you have an extended kitchen section, hopefully you get lucky. And then these new True Living mixing bowls are now going as well. All right, last thing, some, uh, some of my favorite. Don't forget our bags. They usually hang at the front. The black and yellow lemon bags do not or weren't going as of last weekend. The big bags weren't going as of last weekend, but our princess ones, flower ones, and animal ones, they have been going now for, I don't know, a few months. So just don't forget those because these also get left behind a lot. All right, I think that's all for me tonight. I need to get some sleep before I hit the road, Jack. So um, good luck tomorrow. Of course, um, you know, obviously I'm not going to be running in the door until, you know, 7.55. So if you guys have any questions in the morning, don't hesitate to reach out. All right. All right. Good luck. Love you. Bye.
And if you want the $10 blankets, they're going to 